I went in for a $9 um, wash and vacuum on my car and I left with a completely totaled out vehicle. Ouch, only on two a woman frustrated and not just with her wrecked vehicle. She says the way the whole ordeal was handled was just poor customer service. Two Works U reporter Micah Hatfield shows us the damage. Julia Matati pulled her car up under this awning at the Oasis Car Wash in South Tulsa on Friday. Went inside and trusted the employees to vacuum it and drive it into the wash. But this is what the car looked like when it was returned to Matati. The general manager says an employee was driving another car into the wash and ran into hers. You can see the damage to the rear end of the car is pretty severe, so much so that an insurance adjuster totaled it. I immediately said, you know, our insurance will take care of this. He looked at me and said, we'll get you a rental. And I said, absolutely, I am not driving this car. And then he said the owner is at the bank and he is on his way down here to speak to you. Matati says she sat in the lobby of Oasis from 245 until they locked the doors at 615, waiting for Oasis to follow through on their promise by taking her to get a rental car and apologizing for what happened. I can't believe you're not trying to make this right with me. I come in for a wash and vacuum and your employee destroys my car. We went to Oasis and spoke to the general manager. He declined to speak on camera, but disagrees with what Matadi says happened and says they tried to accommodate her and offer her a ride home. It doesn't change the fact that my car is total. Does it change the fact that I'm going to have to go find another vehicle? But just to be, be treated with some common courtesy and respect when they know that I'm a loyal customer. Matadi was able to get a rental car through her insurance on Monday and says Oasis Insurance has since accepted liability. I paid this car off in July of last year. So I paid $6,000 off to pay it, have it paid off. And now I, you know, I'm going to have to be forced to get a different vehicle. The general manager did say the employee who crashed the car was let go that day. In South Tulsa, Micah Hatfield, Two Works For You.